escape. You are almost killed also. I thank God that we escaped. Huh? Now that she went inside, only God knows what next she's going to bring. Maybe cutlass. Hey! Or gone. I don't know when my son will be back. Hey! Hey! Thank God you are back. Bernard, come, come, come. Mama, huh? what is going on here? Ha! Your wife, Jessica, she nearly killed us. She nearly killed us. Maybe Bernard, if you come back, it would have been your mother's dead body. Uh -uh. Mama, eh? who is Jessica you talking about? My own wife or who else? Of course, you know, my wife is not the violent type. Hey, sir, this one is not a show of violence, so she almost killed us. Yes, if not that we escaped from her. Only God knows what will be the story right now. That is, eh? Hey! I don't know. I don't know, I don't know what came over her. Eh? Maybe you went too far with that. But even at that, my wife will not be that too stupid to do anything nasty. I know my wife, I know the woman that I know. That means you don't know whom you are calling your wife. Correct. You don't know your wife. Mm -hmm. Hey! 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 and then he said you should come and see him at the office tomorrow. Are you for real? Yes. So, um, what is it about? Don't worry. I'll give you the food just when I come downstairs, okay? Okay. I have to go and fetch him. Please hurry up. I'm waiting. <laughs> okay, don't keep me waiting, alright? I won't! <laughs> <laughs> alright, darling. Honey, I'm sorry I didn't tell you the outcome of my journey. And that was because of the situation I met at home when I came. It's okay. It's okay, I understand. I don't know why my mom liked badging into us with like the prior information. But I think she has learned her lesson. You're right. I mean, with the approach I gave her, it's certain that she would never return to this house to discuss us again. Mm. Guys, by the way, tell me, how did it go? My love, I went, I saw, and I believed. Honey, you can't believe that some couples that were there a few months ago returned to give testimonies that they were pregnant. You're joking, right? No, I'm not. I'm very serious, darling. Listen, I think we should suspend this orthodox medication for now and focus on herbal. You never can tell. Don't you think uh, these testimonies you talked about, we arranged? You know, people can actually go extra mile to make money and equal advertise their products. 
I don't think so. Listen, darling. Why don't we just give it a try? Hmm? You never can tell if God will bless us from there. There is no harm in trying. All right then, if you say so. Thank you. You're welcome. You know I can say no to you. No. <laughs> From the bed, let's sleep. He has something else in mind. No, 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 are you sure it's just... You have something else in mind? Nothing, I'm asking you a question. Come to bed. <laughs> You have a wonderful curriculum by Thai. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. It's the I. You need to appreciate God for the kind of wife that you have. You know, she practically refused to give up until the management of the company considered your application. Mr. Kanayo. The company has employed you as the production manager of Seaward Group of Companies. Thank you, sir. You see, as part of the company policy, I, we will send them to a supervisor to come to your house to know where you live. Or well, I may personally come by myself to know where you live. Thank you very much. Uh, look, I, I will be humble to have you in my house, sir. It's okay. You see, I will further let you know other benefits attached to your office after my visit to your house. Okay, Once again, congratulations. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you. All right. Thank you. I, I really appreciate it, sir. I will call the secretary to take you to your office, okay? Yeah. Okay, sir. Secretary? Yeah. Come right in. Allow me to move. Oh. Yeah? You know, I'm not like you who has a rich daughter and a rich son in law. Hmm. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> I have to go and farm, struggle for what I will eat. Aubrey, <laughs> neck, don't worry. Hmm? Very soon, riches will get down to your doorsteps. Yes. Because of your daughter, Olaji. Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I say amen to that. Yes, so. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? What will you take? Anything. Eh? Eh? Try and bring it. Eh? 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 I know she brought something for me. Philo! Hey, hey. Stop shouting. Mama, why? What happened? Philo, Nina, come out. Stop shouting. She don't want you. Mama, what did I say wrong? Philo, where is she? Philo! Hey, hey, hey. I said you are shouting. Sorry, Mom. I'm sorry. Yeah. Mom, come out. <laughs> I have your back. Ah, Afama, please calm down. Ha. Don't shout. I don't want the villagers. What did you back. bring for me? Uh, what happened? Can you just calm down? I don't want to stop talking. See, mm. I'm unhappy. And everything will work out as planned. So, can you just calm down? I will tell you everything. What happened? What happened? Didn't you bring? Anna, shh. Ah, ah. What about Anna? Anna, say I don't shout. Ah, who this? Who is here? Who this? Ah, sir. 
please just manage me whichever way that you that you can please uh, I, I did not expect you today it's okay sure I promise that when next you come I will host you but you have to inform me you have to at least <laughs> <laughs> ah it's no problem man I really appreciate it thank you so much have to hope friends it's better it's than not like <laughs> Um, can I you? Yes, sir. There is something I, I observed. Um, what is it, sir? Your maid. Okay. What about her? She's so uncat. So, so uncat. Let's go a critical look at her when she brought this drink. I would suggest if you must get a maid, you go to a corporate maid and get one. Or better still, you can go to the village, get one, and brush her up. You know, for the sake of visitors. Now, I am not ordering you, I'm only making a suggestion. Thank you very much, sir. Your suggestion has been noted. I will, I'll look into it immediately. Alright. I have to be on my way now. Okay? Already? Yeah. I have a meeting too. Okay. 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 Alright. Regards to your wife. Oh, definitely. She will know. Alright. You're welcome then. Thank you. Did anyone look for me? Yeah, a customer came. Uh, she was referring to your table, but I have attended to her. All details in that file. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, how did it go? My dear, I am very happy. My husband now has a better job than the one he had before. Wow! <laughs> Congratulations! Thank you. All oh, thanks I'm to you. For you. <laughs> <laughs> the general manager had to come to our place to know where he lives. That's what they do. They always do that. They make sure that the employee is free of fake identity. I see. Thank you so much for what you did. It wouldn't have been without you. I'm glad for you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Lachi. What are you doing here? Nothing. I've been calling you. I've been looking for you everywhere. Didn't you hear me call your name? Auntie, I'm, I'm shy to come out. You Why? Was... That brother said that I look dirty and don't care. So I don't want to come out. I will not embarrass you. Ah, ah. Ah. Just because of what he said. Yes, and you're not dirty. But I think he's right because I ought to have gotten you new clothes by now. If not for the fact that my husband lost his job and things have become so difficult for us. And so you don't need to explain yourself. I understand. It's okay. I'll get you this set of clothes. Come, come, come. I need to have you this one. You're welcome. Thank you. I'm going to come back then. Come back now with such a Wow. Okay. Is there me a Well, I have some. Good is for you. All this are for you. Me? Yes. All this for me. <laughs> oh, this is so beautiful. Do you like them? Auntie, did you just ask me if I like them? I don't like them. I love them. <laughs> <laughs> okay, just take your time. Bless you and your husband with both male and female children. Amen. Everything you lay your hands upon shall prosper. Thank Amen. you so much. <laughs> it's okay. So why don't you just go and test them? Then you can test them. <laughs> All right. I'll see you at the session now.
You can't continue to stay indoor. Eh? It's becoming too much. Because no one, please, Mama. Eh? I'm ashamed of myself. I'm shy. I can't even face the villagers. Who, who would they say that I went to the city? I couldn't even. even it's okay. It's okay. Eh? Fine. Oh. Don't just mind them. Do you understand me? Don't mind them. You have to live your life. Eh? Don't allow them to make you unhappy. Eh? Look at you sitting on, on your own, thinking. Please, my daughter. Eh? I just feel like going to the city and never return to the village. It's okay. Eh? You have to go and live your life. <sighs> it's okay, my child. It's okay. I'll try. Eh? Try, try. Oh, Thank you, ma'am. Oh, Hola, Hola, Come, 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 come. So, I am taking everyone out to celebrate my new job. Whatever anyone eats or drinks is on me. <laughs> I hope you did not steal someone's money just to impress me. Baby, come on. Are you calling your husband a thief? It was actually the money allocated for my allowances that I want to use for celebration. Uh, does that explain better? It does. Mm. Now I can go and change and get ready to pin the towel red. I know, right? <laughs> Uncle, are you saying me or Lachi? She's going to get ready. Let's go get ready. We have something nice and decent. I see. Should I wear one of those clothes you bought for me? Of course you can. <laughs> Look how naive you are. Okay, I will be down soon. Please don't take time, but you know how you women act. I will take your time. Uh -huh. How are you, beautiful angel? I'm fine, sir. So please, if you do not mind, I am quite busy at home with my family. Hey, hey, hey. Do not cut the call. What do you want? I am missing you. <laughs> oh, come on, don't pretend. Like you don't know what I'm talking about. Hmm? Listen, what I'm asking for is not a big deal. Hmm? Do you understand me? Sir, please, you know that is not possible. I am a married woman for goodness sake. And I am married as well. The ball is in your court. Hmm? Evelyn, the ball is in your court. Is that you play game and your husband will retain the job? Or if you do not want your husband to lose his job, then do not play game. <laughs> the choice is yours. What is this one? Ah, is combination. Is the clothes that Auntie bought for me? That's what I'm wearing. Wait, is this not a gown? Yes, sir. I, and you're wearing this flowing skirt? Oh, oh my oh, god. Because the gown is short, and I have to wear a skirt underneath. Oh, is that what it is? Babe, please, can we postpone this for tomorrow? I am very tired. I'm so weak. No, sweetheart, we cannot. I've already made arrangements. You have to manage, okay? Let's go. You want to go like this? No problem. Oh, I love you. You have to manage my daughter. Yeah. 
Come right in. Yeah, good day. You sent for me, sir. Yeah, I sent for you. So, how are you faring with the job? Well, um, it has not been easy, I must say, sir, but I'm pushing every day. I'm doing everything I have to do to finish everything on my table. Yeah, that is the spirit. Pushing. You know, the best way to bring out the best of shoes when you work beyond your limits. That's true. I like that. Keep it up. I will, sir. Alright. Uh, I will be leaving for a meeting in the next two hours. Okay. So, please, I want you to work on this fight for me. Right? You have any problem? Call me on the phone in case I'm not Alright, certainly, sir. I will do so. Alright. Thank you very much, sir. Okay. Evelyn, where are you? Listen, don't try to ignore me like you did last time. I want to see a great hotel and spa. If you dare try to ignore my call like you did last time, I'll have no other option than to come to the house. It's not what we can talk over on the phone. When you come to the hotel, we'll talk about that. I was thinking you are not going to come. Why are you disturbing me, sir? Let us say, I want you again and again. Sir, you must be very stupid with all due respect. You're sick. You need to visit the hospital. Sir, I only accepted to do what you asked me to do. Because that was the only condition you gave me for you to be able to give my husband a job. But not me repeating it all the time. I can't do that. Yes, I know we had an agreement. Sure, I know. But after my experience with you, right in this hotel, here in this bed, everything about that agreement changed. You see, I... I want to have you in again because the feelings have been so strong after that time. I'm sorry to disappoint you, sir. I love my husband. I am married to a woman and I cherish my marriage. I can't do this with you anymore. Then be ready to welcome him home because I'm going to fire him. Do not say I did not want you. Why are you doing this? What you're doing is not fair and you know it. You see, the soul is swelling. But the flesh is weak. Let's do this one more time. And I promise you, I am not going to ask for it again. You promise? I promise. All right. I gave you my word, okay? My word is my bond. Come on. Sir, please. I've, come on, I promised you I'm not going to do it again after today. Okay? It's okay. Sir, it's sir. Okay. It's okay. Sir. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You will like it this time around. When you see a good woman, you're gonna. But when you see a bad woman, you're gonna. You know they hide your days uh -huh. By their character you go know By their actions you go know oh, Why is not taking his calls? A good woman loves with all her I hope you haven't got into any trouble give you all she has 
Uh, honesty and support. Oh, everything in her power, she go do one for you, for you to be happy, oh, happy for her. Uh. Here is the sample of the proposal, okay? Go through it, study very well, but please present it exactly the same way it is. And you're going to make little money from the proposal. So, um, From this breakdown, I the profit here is six million naira. Oh yeah, I'm aware of that. I, 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 I'm supposed to make six million naira as profit. And you say it's it's little. Since I came here, you have been you have been nothing but nice to me. What have I done to deserve this? Ah, let's just say I have come to like you and your family. So I'm doing all this for you so you can take very good care of your family. I want you to be very, very comfortable. Hmm? And I hope you do tell your wife all the help I give to you in this company. I tell my wife almost everything. She's aware of everything that you do for me, sir. I honestly don't know how I'm supposed to thank you, sir. Sir, God bless you. Okay. God will continue to keep you alive, sir. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, you see, I wouldn't want you to tell anyone in this company, no other assistance that have been given to you. Okay, sir. Alright. You can go and trade the proposal and bring it, sir. I can find my signature on it. God bless you, sir. It's not you say, Master. I'm pregnant. You don't give me the leg. Bring your voice down. Why don't you bring your voice down? What is going on? Don't want to put me in trouble. I'm pregnant. How long did it happen? Okay, sorry. What are we going to do? Which one is what are we going to do? I am pregnant and you are aware of it. What else should we do? You have to move it. Yes, you have to move it. I'm a married man. Are you okay to show you? Oh, but I cheat. 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 Oh, There is something I want to ask you. And I need you to tell me the truth. Oh, what is it? What is going on? You've changed. I mean, you go out and come back home late. With excuses of having loads of work on your table. The other day you came back home drunk. What is happening? Oh, honey. There is no problem. And, uh, to answer your question straight, there is nothing going on. 
You know we are observing the do's and don'ts in this house, right? And of course, of course. I do observe it. I'm worried because we're supposed to be closer to each other now, so why are you far away from me? <laughs> ah, you just hit the nail on its head, eh? <laughs> I know where you're going. Hmm? You miss me so much. <laughs> and especially in the other room. You miss me so much, right? <laughs> Don't worry. I will fix it. Trust me on this. I will fix it. Hmm? Sweetest angel. My golden jewel. My. <laughs> My one and only. Eh? Oh. <laughs> My golden oh. jewel. Don't worry. I'll pick the diamond in the room. <laughs> no, you're not know, lucky, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Please, I've come to ask you if there's anything more or any way that we can handle this your pregnancy. Because there will be serious con There will be dire consequences if Evelyn finds out about your pregnancy. The only solution I'm seeing here is for me to have this baby. You. I have to have this baby. So what I'm saying, I'm not hearing what I'm saying. Wait, are you, are you thinking of an abortion? Child, but I don't want a child this way. I don't want a child like this. They will actually help me. I can't have an abortion. I can't. Chibu, what you give me for my mother? I cannot do. I can't. I can't this child. What exactly is the problem? I think she's been going through some stress. And that has risen her BP. It's actually made her BP rise abnormal. Can I ask you a question? Has she been going through stress lately? Well, um, aside um, stress associated with her work, I don't think I can place my mind or my thoughts on anything that might be stressing her right now. Okay then, but with the look of things, due to her present situation, you need to make sure she's not going through any kind of stress. Okay? It's very important. What do you mean by her present situation? What are you talking about? 
She's two months gone. I thought you knew that. Evelyn is pregnant? Yes. Eight weeks to be precise. Today. Um, my wife is not feeling fine, so I had to rush her to the hospital. Oh, oh, oh. So sorry about that. How is she now? Uh, well, the doctor says she's pregnant. But uh, her BP is abnormally high. Which he said is caused by stress from work. Alright then. Uh, I'll come over to the house on my way home to see how she's faring, okay? So thank you very much for your understanding. I really appreciate it. Okay, sir. This is exactly two months I slept with Evelyn. There is a chance that unborn baby could be mine. Yes. Maybe God wants to bless me with a baby through her. I won't let this opportunity to slip away. Now. Changing skin color, not being friendly to some strange animal. Yeah, we just have to cope. Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, congratulations. <laughs> I don't even know what to say now. You will be a father. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> wow. I'm happy for you, man. Thank you very much. Yeah. Thank you very much. I have to go now. Okay, sir. All right? All right. Let me see you all. Okay. What are you doing in my house? I am here to give you a very stern warning. Stop harassing me. Stop talking about my... I mean, the little stuff that we did, I don't like the way you keep talking about it. And I'm also here to tell your wife what happened where it happened and how it happened. Then go inside there and tell her. You think you can scam me with this cheap blackmail? Never. You cannot go inside there and tell her if you have the guts. You really think I am joking with you, don't you? Try it. Hey, 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 hey. Get your hands off me. Come back here. Come here. Get here. Get to my house. Stop harassing me. Yes, I asked you for something, a favor. You demanded something from me. Now you are using it against me. Why? Why are you doing this? Listen and listen real good. That which you did in the secret has yielded a fruit. What the hell are you talking about? So you want to know, right? The child in your womb. The child in your womb belongs to me. Are you mad? Are you stupid? No, seriously, are you such a fanatic fool? Why would you think that my child belongs to you instead of my husband's child? <laughs> and of course you know you're lying. The child belongs to me and not to him. You know what we did? Of course, you know the child is mine. And listen, I'm not too quiet. And you give what rightfully belongs to me to someone else. Never, not in this life, and not forever. The child belongs to me.
When you see a good woman, you go down. But when you see a bad woman, you go down. You know they hide your diseases. By their character, you go down. By their actions, you go down. Oh, oh, oh. A good woman loves with all her heart. She will give you all she has. Uh, honesty. Honesty. Yes, I love. I overheard your voice from inside. Who are you quarreling with? Oh. It is nothing serious. Uh, yeah, I, I. It's nothing. Yeah. Are you sure? Come on, honey. Very sure. <sighs> what are you hiding from me? I am not hiding anything from you, my love. Stop being unnecessarily suspicious. Come on, let's go inside. Don't give up. Don't give up. So I think you need to go through the document you sent to me. Why? Because there were lots of errors in your imputation. Um, isn't it? Thank you for your observation. Thank you, sir. I would go through it, okay? Thank you. And sir, please, one more thing. I I have noticed I've been bothered about something lately. Whatever it is, please handle it properly because it's really affecting your job performance. Thank you. You requested to see me. What's the issue? You haven't said anything since I told you about my condition. Olache, look. It has not been easy for me. My wife is also pregnant. How am I supposed to just tell her something like that? You want me to jeopardize that pregnancy? Calm down, I will handle things, but you need to give me some time. I am tired. Okay? You need to tell your wife. You need to tell your wife that I am pregnant for you. So she would stop ordering me around. I am also carrying your child. It's alright. I will discuss with her, okay? About it. But please, you have to be patient. I need some more time. I can't just relate that with her without any emotions. Put yourself in my shoes, please. You need to calm down. To your mother, you know nothing about like some grasshopper who's been hungry for days. Uh, I'm just, 
Tyler, don't tell me that, please. What's going on? What the hell is going on? Uncle, are you going to tell her? Should I just tell him myself? Ah, at the moon, Gage. What is going on here? Are you both concealing anything from me? Can someone please talk to me because I am losing it at this point? What the hell is going on here? All that she's pregnant. Ah! Olaji, your water. For who? Olaji, who are you pregnant for? Answer my question, who are you pregnant for? Who is you pregnant for? I just wanted to tell you that the food is veggie. Should I serve you? No, 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 no. Don't worry. I've lost my appetite. I'm fine. I'm okay. Uncle, I know you have not been happy because of your inability to secure a job. But I want you to know that I have been praying for you. Eh? And I know that very soon God will answer my prayer. Eh, please. You should not be starving yourself because of your situation. Pico, you need to eat something. See, Uncle, no matter what you are going through in life, just make sure that you eat something. You put something in your belly. So that when trouble is coming like this, if coming like this, you give it bass, both. Left, right, center. You give it. But if you don't have food in your belly, a, a problem might just fall you on the ground. I will not be able to stand up again. Eh? Pico, eat something, please, I'm begging. Food, I will, I will come and eat. Okay, thank you, sir. Let me go and serve you. Ah, Uncle, welcome, sir. Well, I, what's the meaning of this? Why are you dressed this way? Uncle, is is um, I said I bought the dress from you. It's one of the dress she bought, so I decided to wear one today. Wait, your auntie bought this for you? Yes. To wear in the house? Yes, sir. Uncle, don't you like the dress? It's beautiful. It's fine. Auntie bought for me now. The Uncle does not like the dress, so but it's fine now. Why are you locking the door? Oh, 
Everything happened really fast. It was a mistake. It in my was a mistake indeed. Indeed, it was a mistake. So after everything we've been through in this marriage, this is the only way that you can pay me back. You can't come home. You are so heartless. What have I done to you to deserve this kind of humiliation? Tell me. Baby, please, I'm sorry. From the depth of my heart. I'm sorry, I am. So, so because you wanted to have a piece of a waist, you forgot what we've been through in this marriage? Just like that. Don't you dare touch me with those filthy hands of yours. Don't. I'm losing it. Be here. I was going to sit down. Why? I'm not stupid. I know I've not been able to conceive. I don't understand what you're talking about. Your behavior towards me has changed. If you no longer feel comfortable taking your calls around me, if you go out and come back home anytime you like, and then you give me flimsy excuses, 
Listen, I know you've been patient with me, okay? I think it's about time you get another wife. You can call your mom to bring one of those those girls for you to get married. So she can give us children. Enough! Enough of this madness! Enough! Stop it this minute! Stop! I won't stop. And I am not mad. Listen. I want you to be a happy man. Just get a woman. You know, to come here and give us children. You have my support. You have my permission. There will be no need for that. I already have a mistress. Oh. My instinct never lied. I knew there was something you were hiding from me. Go ahead and, and bring her home. I I want to see her pregnant. Please. She's already pregnant. Okay. You should be happy. Okay. Please bring her. I want to meet her. another man's wife. What? Another man's wife? How? I want to take Olaji with me. I don't understand. Olaji, who is this one? He's my boyfriend. Are you both convinced now? Olaji. Please, if they don't want you to go with your bags, I will get all of that for you. Just follow me, let's get that from me. Uh, excuse me. Is you Chuku or whatever you call your name? I will not allow you take Olachi away. Why? She's carrying my child. That's not true. The baby belongs to me. <laughs> village girl you used to know. I am now a city chiquito. <laughs> you can actually say that again. No longer that village girl I used to know. Mm -mm. <laughs> I must say you're very beautiful. Thank you. Babe, uh, where's your boss? Oh, they went out. Oh. Okay, uh, babe, locating this place was not really easy. Oh. You need to see the unnecessary directions those persons were giving me. But thank God for one good soul that gave me this particular direction. And finally, yeah. yeah. The most important thing is that you are here with me. Oh, yeah? We finally get to meet each other. I'm so happy, babe. I... Let's go inside. Really? Mm -hmm. Okay. I you like the food. <laughs> like you say. <laughs> I love it. I, very delicious. Okay. Yeah. Should I get more? Would that be okay for you? <laughs> this is enough for me. I'm okay with this. Okay. 
Please show. If I'm sure. Mm-hmm. About the food. Of course. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure about this food. Okay. But then, I'm not sure if I'm okay about the other food. I would actually like to have a special meal though. A special meal? <laughs> yeah. Okay, what could that be? <coughs> I would like to eat you. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, I'm serious. Like, you've actually given me your food. Then I would like the other food that your mama gave you. Uh. You want to eat what my mama made? Yeah, it's her pleasure. <laughs> Come on, babe, I've actually missed it though. <laughs> hey, you're so pretty. Come on. Come on. Okay. That's how it happened. <laughs> Although I can't say who the real father of the baby is. Okay. Wait. So you mean we both slept with you on the same day? Oh, Marco, you are doing very well. What? She does not mean anything. She does not say anything. Until a paternity test is done, I am not going to allow you to take her away from me. Can you just listen to yourself? Listen to what? Listen to what do you want to listen to? You have the ghost to sleep with my gear, yeah, you are saying all this kind of things. You are not going to come into my house and shout at me, okay? I will not allow you to take Olachi away. I am taking Olachi away and there's nothing you or anyone in this house can do again. I will not allow Olachi to go. Hey, Mr. Man, respect please leave my way. Re respect yourself. Then leave my way. Olachi, please. Else you will do what? Olachi, I don't understand what is going on here. Why am I dragging this pregnancy with um, Izu or whatever you call his name? Why are we in competition about who the owner of this, this, this pregnancy is? Why? Listen to me. I will not allow you to go with him until it is proven that he got you pregnant. Okay? Okay. So, what are we going to do to determine the, the paternity of this child? We'll have to go for a DNA test. That's what we will do. Okay. We'll go to a competent hospital and dare to be proven who actually got you pregnant. Okay, I will, I will invite Sisu to come over. Better. Where you back into? And what does it look like I am doing? Hey. Hey, wait. Dead! Don't you dare touch me! Where do you want to go to? Where do you want to go to right now? I am tired of the harassment and harassment from you and your stupid concubines. I want to leave the house so you guys can have enough space to fall with each other. Right? That's what you've always been up to. You want to leave this house? Are you expecting me to allow you to leave this house? Knowing that you're pregnant? You know I can't possibly do that. I have to take care of you and the baby. Oh, really? Well, I do not need your care. Go take care of your concubine and other concubines that I do not even know about. 
Don't touch me! Don't touch me! You are not going anywhere. You are not going anywhere. Oh, madam, I have decided to employ your husband after convincing my superiors. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. I really appreciate. Thank you so much. It's okay. You won't regret this, I promise you. It's okay. He will become a new production manager. As a matter of fact, that is the post that comes with lots of benefits. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you. All right, I will not fail to let you know that this post will become possible only if you will abide by my conditions. Conditions? I, I don't understand. All right, I will just go straight to the point. Only if you, if you will sleep with me. What? Sir, I, I, I am a married. I, I, I am a married man as well. Listen, there are sacrifices we make just to keep our family running. Do you know the kind of sacrifices I made to? be on this seat that I am today. So many sacrifices before I could attain this position. Oh, come on. You can as well make the same sacrifice. If truly you value this job and you really want your husband to be happy. I don't want any scandal, please. I hope no one is aware of this. Not at all. You can look around. There's no recording device in this room. I don't want scandal as well. The only one that knows about this is just us. You and I. Secondly, this will be the first and the last time we will be doing this. Deal or no deal? Deal. Mr. Kanayo, now that it has been proven that you are the father of the unborn child, I just want to sincerely apologize for all the stress I put you through. That's okay. Please, sir, take care of her. Mr. Kanayo. I am sorry. Sincerely sorry for my actions. I'm just been so desperate to be called a father. I am sorry. And I hope you understand. Now that it has been proven that I am responsible for your pregnancies, I would like to ask, sweetheart, that you please forgive me. I know I have hurt you, but please find it in your heart to forgive me so that we can leave in peace and harmony. Hmm. Please. I am very sorry. What happened was not intentional. Please, find a place in your heart to forgive me. Pico, because of the unborn baby. Please, I am sorry from the depths of my heart. I'm sorry. 
Olate. Olate. You came to my house with nothing. And guess what? You're going to be leaving my house with nothing. You think you can come to the back door to drag my man with me? My husband, you know, Mokeko, with too much money. You think you can come in from nowhere and just drag my man with me? But let me tell you something. Prosperity will judge you. God will judge you. And devil will judge you. I swear, I will make this house so hot for you. I will make it unbearable and uncomfortable for you. It will rain on you, Robokoto Shaba. You will understand it. And as for you, since you cannot control that tiny thing in between your legs that you call a freak, I will help you control it. Both of you will hear from me. My dear, that is what has been going on. I am tired of my husband's recent attitude. I think I want to leave him. I can no longer tolerate his excesses. Listen, girl. You're my good friend. And you're like a sister to me. I will never deceive you. Don't you ever think about leaving your home or your husband. Don't do it. For how long will I put up with this? As long as you love him. Yes. As long as you love him, you will keep praying for him. You will keep supporting him. And God, in his infinite mercy, will definitely see you through all these challenges that you're going through now. Please don't do it. <sighs> Easier said than done. I know. Thank you very much. And I could count on you. This is your hope. Don't give up. She never gave up. Don't give up. In any challenge. Why not? Where did he go? Where did he back off? Hey, that stupid woman that refuses to try her child off. So you came into my compound to come and insult me, calling me out of that nest. Your wife and I are you alright? You are the one. Your generation, your father, your mother, they are the one useless. By the way, why did you even decide to to to, to allow your daughter to snatch my, my daughter's husband? Oh shit. Oh, again. You are talking nonsense. I don't even know what you are talking about. Oh really? Yes. Oh go my Come on, yeah, boom. Oh boy, when you die, you put that in dry. Oh, you die now. Really? Yes. You see, you you are a stupid woman. You are that stupid woman I have never ever seen in my life. Stop it. 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 Tell him to sleep up here, I chill here. You cannot even point in the mall. Can you hear me? I'm one. I told him, I told him, I told him. You are very, very stupid. stupid woman. Is that all you got to say? And now let me tell you, if she do not leave that house, what I will do to her? Even you here, you, you cannot. Like it. You won't like it. Yes. I'm okay. If you, if you touch this, if you, 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 when you see a good woman, you got no. But you, when you see a bad woman, you go know. In other hand, you're the season. Uh, by their character, you go know. By their actions, you go know. Oh, oh, oh. A good woman loves with all. Honey, I'm sorry. She will give you all she has. I'm sorry. I am not that person you think that I am. And that is why I am here to apologize to you to forgive me, please. Forgive you? Did you say I should forgive you? I'm sorry. 
That would be so difficult for me to do. You know, I, I know it will be too difficult for you to do. Considering the fact that I that I've betrayed your trust, your love, everything. I have let you down. But please. All I ask for is a second chance to prove to you that I, that I am a changed man, please. And what about your numerous girlfriends? What about them? Waste of time. Waste of energy. Waste of money. I wronged you, yes, of course, honey. I know that I wronged you. But all I'm asking for is a second chance. A second chance to prove my love to you. I have gone astray. Of course, yes, I know that I've gone astray. You were there for me when I had nothing. You said yes to my proposal when I had nothing. You labored with me. You struggled with me. You built this home with me. We suffered together. I betrayed your love. Yes, I know I did. I betrayed your trust. Yes, I know I did. I betrayed everything. Everything. But I am here asking for a second chance. Please, let us come together. Let us come together like we were from the beginning. Let us unite as one this time. Please, honey, give me a chance. Let's build our home again. Let's build our union again, our love, everything that made us one. Please. I'm sorry, I can't. Honey, 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 please, 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 I beg you, please, don't do this to me, please, honey. I brought this. What? Your resignation? Why? I can no longer work with you after knowing the process through which I was employed in this company. Mr. Kanayo, what happened has happened. Let us put it behind us and work together as one. I will not work with you. After knowing what has been happening in this corrupt and dubious venture, I cannot continue to work with you. I will not work with you, sir. I had hope 
you won't regret this action. I hope you won't. God is my help. He will supply me all my needs. I have resigned from Sea World Group of Industries. Eh? What? Why? I cannot continue to work in a company where I was employed through a dubious means. This administrative decay must end at all levels. I have taken my decision and that is what I want to do. I support you, sir. Will you shut up your trap? Look at who is talking. You overemphasized Homo sapien. And as for you, you are speaking grandma. Before you think of quitting that job, did you also remember that you have two pregnant women in your house? Oh, you forgot. Listen, I do not want to be thrown to the streets with this condition. This one is already a dustbin. I don't know about that. But for me, I refuse to starve in this house. Better go back to that company to avoid problem. I believe that God will come to the force. God will come to for you. Was it God that told you to be stupid or foolish? Okay. Don't even leave me! Hey, don't you dare even leave me, oh! Don't even leave me at all! You will go back to that job! Because I don't want to starve! I have to feed my baby very well! Like I said, I don't know about your second dose being, but for me, you have to take care of me very, very well. You didn't know. You did not know. I have said my piece. I have said my own piece too. Go back to that company. Go back! You never, you never. When you were doing it, you did not know. You want to quit the job. Let me take it that you're joking, you know. In fact, I know you are playing. Because you have gone back to that job finish. You must go back to that job, Because this house will not contain us. And as for you, you have the mouth to talk. He's talking, you're talking. Okay. I will deal with you in this house. You, I will, I will show you shaking. Will you bring down that rubbish, shredded, rotten leg from my chair? Bring that leg down! I said you should bring that leg down. Because I'm managing your dirty buttocks on it. You want to hang those rubbish, rubbish, useless legs on, on top of it like toothpicks. Now, voila. Rubbish. You must go back to that company. I'm talking, you're supporting him. Uncle will kill you. You, you will give birth to a, a rotten scorpion. Not just a child. You will see it. I, I wanted to cook because I'm very hungry. But then I noticed that the kitchen door is locked. Please, can you give me the keys? Auntie? Are you mad? Are you stupid? Have you lost your sense of timing? Is something wrong with you upstairs? No, have you gone bananas? I just said I am hungry, I want to cook. Oh, you are hungry? Really? So when you were opening your two legs wide open for my husband, didn't you know you were going to get hungry someday? Let me ask you a question. Did you keep anything in that kitchen? And your two breasts in that kitchen? The kitchen that I suffered to, to, to stock up with my own hard-earned money. You are asking me for the key. Are you mad? Do you want me to starve? Eh? You're a walking cops now. Look at you. Oh, you don't know you're a walking dead cops. You think you're a woman being? You're not even up to a homo erectus. You're not erect. Now, before I open my eyes, take yourself out of my sight this moment. Is it my fault? Maybe you should tell your husband to learn to control himself. Or maybe you are the cause. Oh, really? Since she knew my husband could not control what is in between his legs, why did you not shut up your own? Why didn't you shut your legs? Please, I need the keys. I need to go make something to Before eat. Before I open my eyes, take your useless, retarded, shredded, useless, godforsaken self out of my sight. Do you want me to die? Do you want to kill me? Is that your plan? You're a walking cops already. Are you alive? Get out of my sight! Imbecile! Look at her! You want to open the door, you want to eat. In my own kitchen, in my own house. 
control his prick? Why do you not control yourself? I, no, we're not sharing the same prick. I understand it. Very soon we'll know who owns the prick, whether it's me or you. Or go form one. Idiot. You want to come and eat? It, it will kill your generation. Ah, my love. My wonderful husband. <laughs> I miss you so much. How was your day? The feather of my unborn baby. You're welcome. I miss you. Oh, baby, miss you so much. Oh, watch. What is the meaning of what you just did now? No, what was the meaning of the attitude you just exhibited right now? You started it. So I am ready to give it to you back to back. You are ready to give it to me back to back? Yes. Listen. Can we please just stop? Tell your dustbin that this house will not contain me and her. Tell your dustbin. Don't call me a dustbin, no. Don't call me a dustbin. And if you want to leave, you can go. I am going to stay. I am going nowhere. In my own husband's house. No transfer. In my own husband's house. Yes. All actually, you will leave my house. Oh. Mm. All actually, I brought you from the scrums. And you will go back to the scrums. I am going nowhere. It's okay. hey, look, I understand that tensions are high. You still have the mouth to talk. Oh, can we please just calm down? You should be ashamed of yourself. This is what you've cost for me. Why did you not control this thing between your legs? Couldn't you have controlled it? Have you seen what you've cost? Take your dustbin out of my house. Don't call me a dustbin! Don't, Don't call, call me! Don't call me! Don't call me! Get your dust out of my house. Get your dust out of my house. Oh, yeah, get out of my seat. Get out of my seat. See your seat. When you see a good woman, you're gonna. But I want to see good in you. Welcome. How you feeling? Better. Okay, you. Ah. So how are you? I'm fine. Looking so beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> so, did you finally go to the hospital today? Oh, yes, I did. And then the doctor gave me. Everything in her power, she could do one for you, for you to be happy or happy for her. What? 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 I mean, I can't believe that the once barren woman will be having a child. I mean, I'll be seeing my baby run around the house and call me mommy. Oh my is this, God! Is this why you've been looking so beautiful recently? Of course. Isn't God wonderful? Uh-huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> mm. yeah. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> Thank you for your patience. It's okay. And Honey, I want to ask you for a favor. Go ahead. Okay, I want you to be more careful this time because the baby and I will be needing you more. Please be careful. Settled. I will be very, very, very careful. Trust me. Okay, thank you. <laughs> I love you, baby. I love you too. I love you, baby. I love you. Come here. Thank you. Come here. My husband, my husband. My darling. Demon room with your care go. Lip rich naked. Eat food for Jesus. For it is written in the Bible that even Jesus himself wept. For food like this, God did, not, see, God did not just give me a woman that knows how to cook. He also gave me a delicious woman. I'm going to... I made food for the father of my unborn baby to eat. Not a pot. Have you gone bonkers? No. Have you lost your sense of timing? No. Something wrong with you? No. Have you gone banana? No. You actually brought food for my husband, this shredded food. No, like, what is your problem? Wait. If you call people who know how to cook 
you will come outside. You that cooks nonsense for a living. For tea cooker. All right, I have had enough of your rubbish. All right, did you just talk back at me? Enough, enough to do my mess. And I'm talking you are eating. And I'm going to put you again on me. Don't you know when there's a situation? Don't you know when there's a situation you, in, your, in your house? I don't like what happened here yesterday. I don't like it. Why can't you and Evelyn coexist in this house? It's not my fault though. It is not my fault. Cha cha! It's Evelyn. She's the one that started it. No problem is this one now. Eh? I can't even leave both of you for a moment in this house again. You better warn her. I will match her down. Tell her that I have single bono. Me already this akam jasuji ne de na village. Unswan your bo. If I give her blow, <laughs> she will just collapse. Eh, eh. Nobody will collapse in this house. Okay, Mona. And nobody is using the hand. Eja jasuji ne de. I come back to this house. Okay. Okay. I'm begging you. In fact. I took a decision, and that is what we're going to do. I'm renting a place, a different apartment for you. You will go there. I'll be coming to see you from time to time. Eh? Yes. Me? Yes, Inugomu. I'll leave this place to a different apartment. Why? Why should I do that? Why? I am not going, no. I am not going anywhere. See this child. This child will stay in the same house with his father. All Archie. All Archie. You will go to that apartment I'm renting for you to stay there, <laughs> whether you like it or not. You carry me. Yeah, para ma para. Just tell Evelyn to avoid me. Simple. She should just avoid me because I will not go. I've said my own home, me live where. I'm here to stay. Live to where? She should just avoid me because I will give up if I, if I pound her. If I, if I. She will try me. She will turn red or black immediately. You see a good woman and you got no. But you when you see a bad woman, you got no. You know they hide your desires. By their character, you got no. By their actions, you got no. Oh, 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 oh. A good woman loves with all her heart. She will give you all she has. Uh, honesty and support to all. Everything in her power, she could do one for you, for you to be happy or happy for her. Uh, hey, what a precious woman. Konanga, what a precious woman. Cause you are that gold. Mama, how are you? Mama, what do you want in my house? Ah, I understand. Nem, just calm down. Eh? There is no need to worry or to ask me that kind of question because I did not come for trouble. This time, I'm here for peace, to make peace with you. Peace? What kind of peace? See, my son has told me everything. He told me that you are pregnant. Eh? See, let me tell you. You see, all those times I was giving you trouble. It didn't come from my mind, though. But now that you have conceived, everything has balanced. It has balanced. Eh? You know you're a beautiful girl. Eh? I'm a mad son. I'm a little animal. Don't worry. Eh? 
Hey. It's okay, Mama. Just go inside. Let me finish what I'm doing. I'll join you. What are you doing? I'm I'm leaving the house. So ah, no, 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 no. You don't have to do anything. I don't want you to do anything that will endanger my uh, grandson because I know he's a boy. <laughs> eh? Just relax. Relax. Sit down. I'll finish. Oh, where are you stop? Hey, don't need to stress yourself at all. This is the reason I'm here. Ah, Mama, ready to do Don't worry. Don't worry. Why? Oh, yeah. Give me the leg. Why? 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 I will be the one to arrange the house, wash your clothes, cook for you, if possible, bet you. I'll go to market. I will do everything. Just sit down. Eat. Eh? Squander my son's money. Whatever you any type of food you want to buy, buy. So bad there. I did. Oh, right, Oh, my daughter-in-law. Eh? Oh, my daughter. Hey, your mother-in-law is here to do this for you and to serve you. <laughs> yes, Mama. That's the situation of things on ground right now. He said he is going to get me a different apartment, but then I said no. I refused. Okay, again. Don't you ever agree to that. In fact, don't consent to that nonsense. Eh? My dear. Don't you ever agree? Eh? So you will turn my own daughter to a second hand material. And he is planning to keep her aside. Akwea, I'm on work. Not my daughter. See, I am coming to the city myself. Mm. I am coming to the city to put things straight. Nobody uses my daughter and dumps her. Maka again. Bam. Okay, that's a good idea, Mama. I'll send you money and our address. Okay. See you later. Back. Back. Allow me to do this. Mama, it's not even that difficult now. I told you that I can handle all the house chores and the kitchen chores. I'm not an old woman, am I? At least I can help you. The most important thing to me is your safety. And that of my unborn grandchild. Hmm? Don't worry. <laughs> Mama, the mama. My son. <laughs> Mama, you're welcome. Welcome. Thank How you. was your day? Very well. <laughs> ah, am I missing something? Mama and I are having a nice moment together. She oh. won't even let you do anything. <laughs> <laughs> no. Mama. You know, I am now in charge of all the kitchen stuffs mm -hmm. with her concern. In this her present condition, she needs to be pampered and I'm ready to do that for her. I'm ready to serve her, cook for her, wash for her, do everything for her. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let me start from where I stopped. Um, why don't you both go inside, enjoy yourself. Let me cook and serve you. It will be my pleasure. Okay. Okay, Mama. <laughs> We're in the bedroom then? Yep. <laughs> okay. It's okay. Together from Kanaya's office. Oh, this is a whole load of work. It's okay. So, should I get you a cup of coffee or tea so it will help you relax while sorting the fire? Secretary? Sir. I don't need that right now. Please. You can go when I need you, I'll call you. Yes, sir. Thank you. Alright. Ah. Oh, we'll 
I start from? Where will I start from? Hello, ma. All right, ma. I... I'll be there in Ezefi. All right, ma. General manager in my husband's company? After everything I did for you, now you're refusing me. Come on, be mad. Madam, oh. please, please understand me. I I know why. I know you made me the general manager in your husband's company. I am not disputing that fact. But I made so much sacrifices as well. We made the love before I got that promotion. Honestly speaking, I love my wife so much. And I made a promise to her that I will never in my entire life cheat on her again. Please, do not make me fail my wife. Do not make me disappoint my wife. Please. Okay. Just this one. Just this one, I promise. Madam, please. I promise I will let you be. Madam, please. If I am in this morning, because I need you. Please, I beg you. I don't want to disappoint oh my, my wife. Darling. Madam, please, Madam. Please, 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 you're responsible. And all I get at the end of the day is that you're sleeping with my wife. Uh, you're sleeping with no, no, no. Can I just explain? I had... This is set up. I, I, I didn't know. I, I didn't do it. If it's just... I can explain how it happened. There is I, I, nothing I, I... to explain, Bernard. There is nothing to explain. You've been sleeping with my wife. No, no, no. Sir, 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 sir. I, 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 I am not sleeping with that. Trust me. I did not you know? Did you do anything? No, no, no. They didn't do anything. Trust me, I didn't. I will just tell him now. You didn't do anything. Sir, I swear. 
We didn't. We didn't. I have nothing to explain. So you be sleeping with my wife? No, 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 sir. Please, just, 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 just. understand me. I, I, just, 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 just. Okay. Officer, is this a setup or what? Arrest him. Excuse me. Huh? Young man. You have to cooperate with us because anything that you do, we we'll use against you in the long run. Officer, stop it. My superior has given me instruction. Move. Chief. I said move. I don't want to see you never! I'm sorry, Pigs, I'm sorry. Leave me alone! I'm not sorry, Pigs. Come on, Pigs. I'm sorry. I'm I'll, I'll be back. Are you sure? Yes. When you see a good woman, then you get love. But when you see a bad woman, then you get love. In other hand, your deserts. By their character, you go know. By their actions, you go know. Oh, oh, oh. You forget? You see you. Don't worry. I will make this house a living hell for you. You know what? You don't even know where you belong to. Cho 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 cho. Do we try it? Or should we try it? Go see you know about that. I don't come. My love, welcome. No, my son, my love. You're welcome. Um, uh, my daughter is not feeling too well. Uh, and she asked me to prepare your meal, so I did. I, I prepared it personally. I'm scared. Oh, God. I'm on Anyway, I won't even allow you to eat that potty. 
Because what they cooked is poison. Ada. Ada, you started again. Why not Wogu? You started again. You respect yourself. But you know how far. Do we start? Hey, come on. Okay. I can just have all the money. I can not I can not me. Sit down there. Ada, you push me. Ada, you try. Are you trying to sit down? Come on, can just have all the money. It's okay. There's no need for that. I'm, I'm not hungry. Please, I'm not hungry. Yes. If you people will not mind, I would just like to go and rest. Oh, we should be hungry by now, huh? But many of us go there. It's lovely. Okay, I should bring it to your room. No, you don't have to. Ah, man, man, come on, come on. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't forget. I don't forget. You see you. I forget. I know why I'm just leaving you. I know why I'm just taking it easy with you. I'm what is that? Why are you taking it easy with me? Come and see the television. Okay, I'm ready. Okay, sit down there. Sit down. Sit down. All I'm saying is that you shouldn't give them a breathing space. Huh? Oh, Mama, what do you want me to do? See, the other day you slept in my room. Why are you denying your poor child the want of his father? Huh? Mama, that's how it has always been. I sleep in the guest room. Why if he sleeps with Kana, you come and let me. Oh, I see. You want to make yourself this in this house? No, you want to make yourself this in this house? All I can Shut your eye well, well. Okay. That is how it happens. What I told you is the truth. Nothing but the truth. This is an absolute act of intimidation. Even though what you did is wrong. I won't leave you here like that. Please. Do anything humanly possible. Anything you know you can do to get me out of this place. Please do because I have suffered. Don't worry. I'll raise a team of lawyers to get you out of this place immediately. Their plans won't work. Thank you. If you do that for me, I will eternally be indebted to you. I owe you that harassment. I'll get you out. Thank you. I called both of you here to let you know that I do not like the commotion that you and your mothers are creating in this house. There is no need for all this fighting and worrying. It has got to stop. If you two don't put a stop to it, I will have to take measures that both of you would not like. My love, it is not my fault. It is all your dustbin's fault. Put the blame on her. This dustbin of yours had the guts to bring her mother to come and fight me in my own husband's house. I can understand that she is the lowest species of the millipede from the planet of Saturn. But she has no right to fight me in my husband's house. Just because she seduced and got pregnant for you. I won't take it. Olaji, please, you will have to talk to your mother. She is my wife, and you have to respect it. Tell your mother, henceforth, I do not want you to insult my wife anymore in this house. So, you're supporting her? My mother and I are the problems here. <laughs> no problem, oh. No problem at all. She see me say anything. No wahala. We shall see. I didn't know what I was telling you. We shall see. This girl is the so lowest species. You are the problem. You are the troublemaker. The lowest species of a millipede on the planet of you. You are a mad woman. You are very slow. You are a mad woman. And if you don't see me anyhow, I'm going to wipe your head. You are a mad woman. 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 Okay. 
That's it, says Joseph, like a newborn baby in a bathroom. They can have a bathroom. They are calling you. You don't think they're calling you. Hey! Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Hey! Oh, Jesus. Hey! 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 You are back. Welcome, eh? Welcome. Um, did the police allow you see him? Oh yes, I. I saw him. How did it go? He's not doing well, but um, I've contacted uh, a team of lawyers, and they promised to get him out soon. For sure. So I can see my son again. Yes, you will. Thank God. Ne, thank you. God bless you for all you've been doing. Eh? God bless you. Um, let me serve your food. No, 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 let me just go inside and rest. I say, no, I will serve you. I don't want you to starve my grandchild. Eh? My grandchild in the womb. I want him to be kicking fight because I know he's a boy. Eh? <laughs> let me go and bring your food. How did it happen? I don't know. You just started. Come, come, come and sit down here. So now that you know that your waist and your, your leg and your head will pain you. May the masquerade call the boy in that people not finish your generation in Jesus. Finish your own in your head. Where are you spending you now? You just said trouble. Oh. You don't know. Here, relaxing, enjoying myself. Mama, Evelyn has started again. She has started again. What has she done this time? Okay. Kanae was massaging my leg. 
and Evelyn just came out from nowhere pretentiously and asked him to stop. <laughs> Mama, why are you laughing? Mm -hmm. Mom, I am here to support you, not to fight your fight. This is time for you to brace up and fight for your rights. Nana. Mama, what do you want me to do? Nice question. See, if you allow them to intimidate you, to treat you anyhow, you and your unborn child will suffer. This is the opportunity you have to gain ground in this family. I know that uh, Izu won't come back to marry you because he's aware that you are pregnant for another man. So, all you have to do now is go in there, confront Kanayo. Yes, go and talk to him face to face, woman to man. Make him to understand that your position in this house is not negotiable at all. He must come and pay your bride price. So you have to grab it, take it by force. And I know the battle line has just been drawn. And who is that? Anna, what happened? Why would that woman speak? So why would she be screaming my husband's name like that? Are you mad? Anna, what happened? It's not said that it's happening in this house. It has to stop. I can't be carrying your child and being treated like a, like a nobody in this house. You have to travel to the village so you can pay my dowry at once. All for my dead body. If we die, my husband will never be your dowry. You should have taken wacky useless in jail. If you step over your dead body, why switch you will die? If it was easy, you have become white. You will die. What was your dowry? Madam, you came through the back door. And you will definitely live through the back door. Oh. Yes, so what are you talking about? You and your son are talking nonsense. I have to nonsense. Okay. Let me find you. Okay. Where is Oko? Okay. I'm talking. So this is the analysis from the lab. Alright, thank you. Yes, Doctor, please talk to me now, please. What's going on? Um, eh? Why is my husband? His blood pressure has risen abnormally. Okay? I think he has partial stroke. Partial stroke. Doctor, what are we going to do? Um, it's a 50-50 condition here, okay? He can be cured, but he has to take his medication judiciously to ensure proper healing, okay? But what I want you to understand, we can manage his health while he's at home. We can always come to render home service and he will be fine, I can assure you. You see what you cost? You see? You see, what? Eh? You see how you want to talk at this point of your life? You are still talking at this point? Well, excuse me, madam. Please, we can handle it with care. Let me tell you, put your tablet inside water, buy a tablet in a minute. 
If anything happens to him, I will tell the whole village that you and your daughter killed him. Yes, you conspired the king. You don't go and get a chance to You know that you're a wicked woman. You are a wicked woman. You are very wicked. How can you say such a thing? Such a thing? Why would I say? What's going on here? I would not see you anytime soon. It's okay. Thank my beautiful wife, especially. She did everything humanly possible to get me out of the police cell. As a matter of fact, she even got her a lawyer who took me on bail. The best of best. My beautiful and pretty daughter, Ender. I appreciate. Thank you so much. My God will continue to bless and protect you for yeah. us. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Mama. Um, I've prepared something for you to eat. What of you? It's okay, but I have to take my shower first. No problem. No, let me have some here for me. Oh, carry bag. Ah, let me <laughs> let me help you carry it. Eh? I don't want you to stress your hair. <laughs> And her mother suffered it. She's the wife, Obria. Eh? They didn't suffer it. Or oh, do you want to tie your destiny to that dead man? Oh, oh, oh. No, you're making a lot of sense. Oh, wow. You're supposed to stay and say, Mama, you are the pushing a man of me here. The ball is on your court. Because for me, first thing tomorrow morning, I say, Wah, 
That's how it happened. I lost my husband in that ugly experience. It's a pity. I am so sorry to hear that. Going back to the village. Oh, no, what? what happened now? You didn't tell me you were leaving. Um, my Eli, I'm sorry. Uh, I didn't tell you because I don't want to disturb you, considering your situation. Uh, I am also going to the village with my mother. Oh. Hmm? Go back to the village. So of all the time you choose to leave in my critical condition, what do you want me to do? Eh, can I, what do you want me to do? When Evelyn and her mother will not allow me to rest, they will not allow me to drink water and drop cup. Today I fight, tomorrow problem, today I quarrel, tomorrow this I'm tired. I am tired of the constant insult and embarrassment from them. I am tired. So I said, let me carry my bag. And leave for the village. When you are ready, when you need me and the baby, you will come over to the village and do the necessary things and carry me as your wife. Then I will come back. Yes, you said the right thing. Now go. I'm going. See you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Mom, you are back. Welcome. How did you go today in the hospital? It wasn't easy at all. A lot of women came for me. So, why is everyone? The whole place looks um, scanty. Nick and uh, Olachi, her daughter, travel to the village. Travel to the village? To do what? We don't know. Your husband persuaded them not to travel. But she refused. And why is he like this? When you see he slept off. I tried to take him upstairs, but he said no. Mama, did you give him something to eat? I tried to give him something, but he refused. My love. Baby. Hmm? Oh. Why didn't you eat so you can take your medications? <sighs> My love, there won't be any need for any medication again. Okay? Eh? Yes. Everything was just an arrangement between me and the doctor. I'm fine. Everything was just an act. It was just pretend. Hey! You scared us all! I'm sorry. 
I wanted to find out who all that truly is. Why would you make me go through such pain? So stress for me. Why would you do that? My love, I apologize for putting you through a lot of stress. I apologize for even impregnating all I in the first place. I shouldn't have done that. I disrespected you. I disrespected our marriage. I apologize for all my wrongdoings. Please, find it in your heart to forgive me. You're so silly. Cow drama king. Okay, sir. All right, right away. What's that? The chief executive officer of Sea World Group of Industries. What does he want? He wants me to report to the office immediately. You need to go at once. What are you waiting for? <laughs> since you took appointment in this company. Quite transparent. And I found out that uh, you resigned because of the grudges you have for Mr. Bennett. Now um, let me let you know that Mr. Bennett has been fired and you have been made as his replacement. And as the chief Executive Officer of C World Group of Companies, I hereby offer you the position of the General Manager. And this appointment is with immediate effect. Thank you very much, sir. I don't know what to say, but um. I'm going to make you a promise today. I will never disappoint you. I already know that. I'm so upset. Sit down. Thank you, sir. When you see a good woman, you got no. But when you see a bad woman, you got no. In other hand, you're the season uh, By their character, you go know By their actions, you go know oh, oh, oh. A good woman loves with all her heart She will give you all she has uh, Honesty and support to all Everything in her 
power, she go do one for you, for you to be happy, oh, happy for her. Ah, hey, what a precious woman, Odokonanga, what a precious woman, Kosliya than gold, Le Mojiriba, this is your house, she never gave up, don't give up, in me any challenge. This is your husband and this is your home. Don't give up. She never gave up. Don't give up. In any challenge. She never gave up. At all. In any challenge. This is love. Follow me and I.